Whoa, busy day today. I've actually had to do a bunch of stuff. I don't like it at all. So I have some thing tomorrow and rehearsal for the thing tomorrow and then Friday, some ceremony. So let's see here at General Jackson's surplus store. It's really a surplus, just army supply surplus. I guess it is. Does that mean used? Because it's not used stuff. I don't know. Anyway, none of this matters. Gotta go buy some stuff. Give the army some more money. Well, I guess give them money because of the army. That makes sense. <clears throat> What's going on with my throat? <clears> throat? That would make sense. Jeez, I have to like actually... Oh, it's because I went to the dentist today. I had another filling put in. And my mouth is still pretty numb. That's what it is. This stuff they put on the top of my mouth because the filling I had like a month ago is still hurting so they put some kind of enamel stuff and it's like dripping down into my throat and uh, it's awesome so anyway going to get this so far today I've just had a bunch of proteiny stuff um, nothing exciting because I can't really taste much and my jaw is still numb but I was starving so I had a Greek yogurt a bag of beef jerky, a protein bar, one of these. Because you can tell what that is. Hold on, hold on, I'll get it. Don't worry. Power bar. And this flavor is, <clears throat> God, lemon poppy seed pound cake. You're not even gonna say that. These are pretty good. They were like my favorite until I found the combat crunch bars and those are way better. But those still aren't bad. And then I had two servings of cottage cheese and an orange. I don't think that's it. Oh, too much stuff. I can feel it. Every once in a while, it just starts going. Ugh, it's the worst. All right, so I'm gonna go do this and uh, try not to fall asleep. I'm so tired. Oh, I'm so tired. Should have more coffee. So it's dinner time. I just had the first part of it. It's late. It's like 8:16. I actually skipped dinner. Because, hold on, let me show you what I've had first so far. I'm about to probably have another one because it was amazing. So I haven't tried this chicken pot pie hot pocket. Crazy. Spicy pepperoni. This was the best hot pocket I've ever had. I know you've never heard me say that before about anything but not about hot pockets I'm probably gonna have another one and I hardly ever eat a hot pocket without regretting it normally I'll have it and like it and then feel like shit but not this one I want another one real bad so we'll see I have a lot of calories I probably got like uh, 1200 left after eating that so ah, crystal light. but the reason I skipped dinner, partially, and Courtney made breakfast, and like I said before, I don't really like breakfast for dinner. So the house is a disaster. Courtney's got some stuff she's working on for a photo shoot on Friday. One year birthday, look at that. Mickey Mouse spelling out one. And then Arsenal's working on some stuff, and then the kids playing. But I was working on my freaking beret, which is what I got earlier when I went to the surplus store and look at this mess oh god it's all over the chair too ah, ah. so if you don't know you can't just buy a beret and wear it you have to shave it so I've been shaving this with a razor for almost four hours it starts off really fuzzy if I had more time I need it for tomorrow I would shave it more uh, I'm done for tonight, for sure. Who knows? I need it tomorrow and Friday. I may do it a little more tomorrow. We gotta shave it because it's all fluffy and stupid and won't form right and looks retarded. And then gotta cut a piece out of the inside. And now I'm gonna need to go wear it in the shower and form it and shape it a little bit, get it to stretch. It actually stretches way down, so I don't even need it for that. But regardless, it takes so long. So I'm gonna show you how to make my brownies. So 
The Ghirardelli Caramel Turtle. Ghirardelli. What? Ghirardelli. Ghirardelli. I like my way better. However you say this stupid fancy name. These, doesn't have to be these, but this is one of the better ones. You just need the Caramel Turtle. Works with any really, especially if like got some fudge or the ones we started it with that I can never find out were German chocolate brownies. Remember that? That's what no, got it. Yes. Did you poking at me did not. You, maybe with someone else you did, not with me. Maybe. No, they have, first of all, they have German chocolate. Second of all, no. Anyway, German chocolate brownies don't exist anymore, so that's why I can't do it. And we started using these. Her story doesn't make any sense. But these work. Caramel's good. Fudgy brownie. I don't know. You want something you can squeeze into there. All right. So you take your pan. Take your stuff. I guess you want your bowl first. So bowl it. What's going on? Bowl it. <laughs> yes. It's a technical term. And then. Look at the directions. Pre oh, pre oven. Oh, okay. Oven's a wreck too. The whole house. Just pretend the whole house isn't a mess right now, okay? Uh, what did I say? Three twenty-five. Okay. Jesus Christ. All right. Preheating. Now you take. Let me look in my eyes. Um, I just want to know. Place water, oil, and egg in medium bowl and stir. I kind of probably figured that on my own. No egg. That's the thing. All right. No egg. You don't use an egg. And let me look at the camera. When you're doing stuff like this, if it says water, use milk because you're going to get a little more flavor. And I mean, negligible calories. Quarter cup of milk. What are you wanting? You've never used milk. I always use milk. No. <sighs> Who are you right now? You're, that's not how you've done them before. It is how I've done them. No, it's not. Oh, I'm looking super sexy. No one can see you because you're like a million miles away. Okay. Well, probably on a normal monitor they'll be able to, so I'll edit you out. <laughs> Alright. Anyway, I do use milk. She's just Never. full of you lies about these brownies. Ever. Don't listen to her. She's trying to screw up my brownies. And third cup of oil. Ignore the fact that it says one cup. Our third cup thing is super janky and leaks everywhere. I got oil all over the counter a minute ago. So I dumped it into this. Bam. They can tell you don't cook a lot. They already know you don't cook a lot. Oh, whatever. I used to. No. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to try to act like it. Now I'll stir it. I'm sure you guys can figure that part out. And stirring is done. Look at that. So nice and compact. Let's see if it's any good. Not bad. All right. Now, you take your caramel. Caramel. <laughs> Stop bothering me. Squeeze it in to the stuff. It's been so long since I've made brown. How long has it been since I made these? Like years? Mm. Where did we live last time I did this? No, you made them before we moved into this house. Made them like at our last house? house. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at that caramel. This reminds me. I'll always remember. Isn't it? I got weird. I got those things. Those strange little completely why am I forgetting the word inconsequential moments in your life that you'll just remember forever when I was like five I was with my mom in the kitchen she was on the phone and we were about to make caramel apples so she had a bunch of those little caramel cookie pieces that you melt and I asked her if I could have one and she held up her finger and I thought she meant one but she meant give me a second because I'm on the phone so I ate one and then she got off the phone and said, I was telling you to hold on a second. That's the whole story. That was it. I didn't get in trouble or anything. That's somehow stuck with me forever. And I don't know why. And I'm sure that's Courtney's first time hearing that story. Oh, that's my first time hearing that story. <laughs> hilarious. 
All right. Done. Looks just like it did last time. You don't even know if this is old or new, do you? All right, so caramel is in. I don't know where the package went. Anyway, doesn't matter. Now we gotta put it in the pan. Oh my god, I'm just gonna pick it up like a monster. You have a problem? <laughs> nope. Got it. And just use your fingers to spread it around. You should have a cooking show. I do have a cooking show right now. <laughs> It'd be the same things over and over again. <laughs> All right, almost got it. I don't know if it matters if they're lopsided or not, since it's kind of like liquidy. I'm gonna assume yes, so make it perfect. You don't get the kind of thing that kind of sucks about this is you don't really get any batter to eat because you just yeah no do like we've always done and just eat them out of the out of the pan yeah. 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 I say we, maybe I just mean me. <laughs> Probably. I have more self control. Alright, and now you're done. Now you can eat them. <laughs> <laughs> the gooeyest brownies ever. No kidding. Uh -oh. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Last thing in the world I'm worried about is getting salmonella. I'm an American. We don't have salmon do in this country. We <laughs> do care about. You only get salmonella if you lick the shell. All right. Now you put them in the oven. God, something's wrong with my hip. Bending down like that. Huh. God. I think something's shattered. All right. What was that? What was that noise you just made? <laughs> What's <laughs> wrong with you? You sound so old. <laughs> You're like 90. I feel old. Oh my gosh. Look at you. Call me 90 or sitting here making quilts. <laughs> I have a photo shoot coming up, so I'm making a banner for it. Yeah. I'm being crafty, man. I almost just kicked you, but then I realized I couldn't use my right leg. <laughs> oh, I, I'm glad that's what you realized. Because my, <laughs> my hip is shattered. <laughs> Look at this, you distract me and start the timer. How long do you cook? Uh, how big is that pan? I have no idea what pan you use. The... Is it a square pan? Yeah. We have a square pan? Yeah. Oh. Um, I don't know. I can't even think about brownies since I have a brownie pan. We'll say 8 by 8 glass. 45 minutes. How long? That sounds way too long. No, you normally do like 30... I want to say 35. Alright. Me and YouTube are putting our trust in you. I mean, do 30 and, well, I say, but you can't really check them. Yeah, that's the thing. You cannot check if these brownies are done because they don't solidify until they've been out for a while. So you get them, you can literally just take the pan and just pour it onto the floor. And they're done. So you set your time and that's what you do. It's never gone awry for me yet. So I'm sure this time will be the time that they suck. And I need to go sit down because my hip is shattered. Are you excited though? <sighs> excited. Like you're going to die? Oh, yeah. Cheese? Yeah. But I'm not going to eat that many. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. You eat one and you feel like you're going to die. They're so amazingly good. But yeah. you're going to die afterwards. Yeah. It's all right though. Worth it. I've sold them. <laughs> Jesus. All right. I'm going to the hospital. So I think we messed up. The brownies, I didn't check them at all. And that is not how they're supposed to look. Those look like regular brownies. Oh my God, I'm so angry. Yep, throw these in the trash. All right, so I just started cutting. And I don't know, there's maybe a little, God, I'm so bad at cutting even. These are all kinds of messed up. There might be a slight chance that these are okay. I don't know why the outside. I mean, they cook too long, but I've never had this happen before. Like, you can cook them way over time. Usually, they're sitting in there boiling. So, not sure what happened. Oh my god, these are so, <laughs> these sizes are so off. 
All right. Well, we might be okay. It's just so weird. Stupid oven. Look at that brownie. I don't know what the deal's at the top, but they worked. Uh, I guess that's not the right. It turned out how it was supposed to. Look at that. See? That's how they stay. Now, if you let them get cool, then they won't be quiet as runny. But it's next still morning, like this. Yeah, the next morning. God, oh, that's the best. That's the problem. Yeah, if you can make it through the night and you wake up in the morning and you have them for breakfast. And then you really want to kill yourself. <laughs> Horrible. Start the morning cool. off right. <laughs> God. That was still pretty hot. Mm-hmm. So it's supposed to stay so. And you need like five glasses of milk. You don't. This is this is the amount of milk I'm using. She's just yeah, crazy. Insane. So try these brownies. All you do is leave the eggs out. Not a big deal. You said something. What? Thought you said something about milk. Oh, See? Yeah. He's not used to add milk. That's why he's not saying anything about it now. It's not mandatory. It just helps a little bit. It's not noon time. Are so hot. Here are the seconds. Courtney's already giving me shit about it. But I still have almost 400 calories left after I ate these, so. I don't know how you're eating that. I literally.